guys, so today I'm going to be doing my November favorites, and I've liked a lot of things this month, so I thought that I would just get into it. So my first and biggest favorite of this month has been my puppy, Ozzy. <laughs> he's an Australian Shepherd mix, and he's just the cutest thing ever, and I absolutely love him. And he's only going to be small for not that much longer, so soon I will not be able to pick him up anymore because he's going to be a very big dog. But he's just the sweetest, cutest, most playful puppy ever, and I just love him. My next favorite for this month has been a bag that I bought at Winners, which is one of those like discount store kind of things where products get sent in and they're marked down. So it's just like this black mini backpack kind of purse and it just has studs on the straps and I find this like so convenient because I hate carrying around a purse all the time with me as I just find it annoying on my shoulder and whatnot and this one is like perfect for that because you don't even know that it's like there and it's just like the perfect bag for literally everything and it has like a secret pocket in the back that you can put like your wallet or your phone in if you're say like at a mall or something you're worried about someone like stealing stuff from you because obviously if it's on your back it's not as safe but this has just been like my favorite bag ever since I've bought it this month and I plan to be using it for a long time coming. My next favorite has been Panama style hats like this one and this blue one that I have. Um, the one that I'm wearing on my head right now is from Forever 21 and this one was about like $20 or something. Um, and then this one is from Little Burgundy and it's like a navy blue colored hat and it has a black leather band going all the way around it and this one was about 25, 30, something like that. So I've been loving these hats. I feel like they add like so much to an outfit and they're just super cute and they're really good if you're having a bad hair day. So definitely a necessity. My next and last like fashion-y favorite has been this specific flannel and I featured this in my um, lookbook for like fall winter lookbook or whatever like outfit idea thingy and it's just this green and um, blue flannel and it's like that thicker flannel material like the warm one um, and this was from Forever 21 it was cheap and whatnot but just flannels in general like I love them so much and I find that they just like are so fashionable without even trying which is why they're like my favorite thing ever so I definitely want to have like the biggest flannel collection in all of Canada. It's my life goal. Cool. And my last kind of, I guess it's a jewelry favorite, is this necklace, which I got from Urban Outfitters. And I've just been loving like little layering necklaces like this, like ones where there um, is two things like at different lengths. I'm pretty sure there's a name for that, but um, this one has been one of my favorites ever, and it just has two little stones. Um, on a gold chain and I actually got my best friend one of these too in a different color as like best friend necklaces so I have just been loving that. And now into my makeup favorites. So I have two products from the drugstore and three products from MAC. So let's just go into MAC first. I've been loving, again, I used to use this all the time, their Mineralized Skin Finish Natural and mine is in light. Um, they really changed the packaging and I really like it. It's magnetic now which is cool. Um, it also has a mirror on it now, which is really handy for like touch-ups and whatnot. Um, this powder is just amazing. I love the coverage. It gives like a really sheer, but like just evens out your skin tone and whatnot. And just love this. Especially because on a day-to-day -day basis, sometimes I don't want to wear foundation. So I just always go to that and it's just amazing. The next two products are lipsticks from MAC. The first one is the one that I'm wearing right now, which is Rebel. I've had this for a while now, like since last Christmas, I believe, but I just absolutely love this color. Will always love this color. I love dark lips. I find they're just such an easy statement to make, and they just look amazing on like almost everyone. So I just love them. Um, and the next one is a new one that I just got, and it's Velvet Teddy. Um, the first time that I put this on, I didn't think it looked good. You definitely have to wear a lip liner with it, I think. Personally, I like to wear like a pinker like ruddier lip liner or like a purple lip liner just to like kind of tone down how brown it is on me and just add some more of like a tone to it other than brown but it looks really good if you're going for like the Kylie Jenner kind of look this lipstick's amazing it looks exactly like how she does her lipstick so if you're interested in that I would definitely check out Velvet Teddy so for lip liners that I like to pair with Velvet Teddy I like to use this one which is Mauve Shimmer 
from Rimmel and it's just this like purpley neutral kind of tone and I just use this to outline my lips before I put Velvet Teddy on and it's just it's amazing. This was super cheap from the drugstore so definitely love that. Last makeup favorite has been this mascara. I ran out of my um, Better Than Sex mascara so I had to get one from the drugstore because I'm poor so I had to get one from the drugstore. And this one is the Voluminous Million Lashes by L'Oreal. Um, not as good as Better Than Sex mascara but it's up there and I've been really loving it this month since I've gotten it and I will continue to buy this if I can't get the other one. Now we're just going to go into other favorites from the month. So. I've been loving these vitamins, which is, sounds really weird. I've been trying to take multivitamins lately just because I want to be healthy and I tend to get really sick in the winter months, so I'm trying to not get sick. Um, and these are just the best vitamins ever. They're gummy vitamins for adults. So if you hate regular vitamins, try these ones. They taste so good. They're gummy. They just remind me of childhood, except they're for adults. And they're just amazing. And there's so many in this freaking container. It's just amazing. I just love them a treat every morning and then my last favorites are just some songs and um, they're all from well Taylor Swift and One Direction have released their albums I think it was in November Taylor Swift might have been earlier One Direction released their album in November and I've been absolutely loving it um, my favorite songs from the One Direction album are Fool Fool's Gold <laughs> Fool's Gold why did that take me so long Fool's Gold Stockholm Syndrome and Change Your Ticket those are my favorite songs and I really like Act My Age or Act Your Age or whatever it's called that song it's so funny I always dance like Irish dance around my house that song so been loving that and then I love Taylor Swift's new album too um, my favorite songs for that are Blank Space um, what's it called One in Wonderland and Wildest Dreams those three are my favorite songs from Taylor Swift's new album well, I hope that you enjoyed my favorites video thumbs up the video if you did and don't forget to subscribe Comment down below what your favorite thing from the month of November was, and I'll be sure to read all the comments and reply to as many as I can. So, thanks for watching. Love you guys. Bye.